Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the Kiwi Lads channel. In this video, I'll be letting you know the Hurricanes vs Crusaders starting lineups and reserves for the upcoming game of Super Rugby Pacific. But if you do enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. But nonetheless, let's get straight into these lineups. Right, so this game, it is the first of three that will be taking place on the Saturday, 4.35pm is when this one is kicking off and it is going to be played at Sky Stadium. So a home game for the Hurricanes. They will be looking to try and build themselves towards another victory, although they have got a very tough opponent in the Crusaders up against them. But we will start with the home side in this game, the Hurricanes, and they are going to be as follows. Number one, it is Pori Rackety Stones. Number two, Asafa Moa. And then at number three, it will be Tyrell Lomax. Now the locks, it is going to be James Blackwell at number four. Number five, they have got Scott Scrafton. So the same as they actually had last week, and also a very common lock duo that they do like to go with. For the Hurricanes, although loose forward wise, they are going to have a change, and that is a debut. At number six, it is going to be TK Howden, does play in the Bunnings NBC very nicely. I believe he is a Manawatu boy, and it will be pretty awesome to see him get a Super Rugby debut. Number seven, once again, it will be Duplessis Karefi, who can be very good in a breakdown, although sometimes goes right on that verge of whether or not it's a turnover or a penalty. And unfortunately, when you're playing on that fine line, you are going to have that risk and reward factor, and normally, doesn't end too well, but hopefully he does have a good game here for Duplessis Karefi. And then now number eight, it is going to be the captain, Adi Savi, who will be looking forward to getting this challenge up against the Crusaders, who have been in some pretty good form as of late. Although the Hurricanes, after that loss to Moana Pacifica, they've really been fired up, and they are hoping to be able to get themselves yet again another victory. Now looking through at the back line, number nine, it is going to be TJ Perinara, and then number ten, they have gone with Jackson Garden Bashup. So actually the same as they did have last week for their 19 combo. Although there is one change in the back line, but we will get to him in a very short moment. Number 11 for this game, it will be Wes Hulson. Once again, the midfield is going to be made up of number 12, Geordie Barrett, and number 13, Billy Proctor. So I'm not sure what's happened. But Geordie Barrett, they seem to be favouring him at inside centre at the moment. So I don't know whether or not that's a choice that he has made. Or maybe there is something that they are seeing that they do want to keep on trialling him at number 12 see whether or not it can make a big difference. Number 14 for this game, it will be the bus, Julian Savia. And then at number 15, they have got Josh Morby, who does get his opportunity there. So last week it was Ruben Love. This week, Morby does get the nod to be able to start this game at 15. But nonetheless, that is a starting lineup. Now we look through the reserves, and they are going to be as follows. Number 16, James O'Reilly. Number 17, Alex Fidel. And then at number 18, it is Tavita Mafaleo. Then at 19, it will be Caleb Delaney. Number 20, Devon Flanders, then the replacement backs for the Hurricanes. 21, it is Jamie Booth, number 22. They have actually got Balin Sullivan. And then at number 23, as that fly half slash fullback cover here, it is going to be Ruben Love. But that is the starting lineup and reserves for the home side, the Hurricanes. Now we look through at the challenges, the Crusaders, and they are going to be as follows. Number one, Joe Moody. Number two, Cody Taylor. And number three, Fletcher Null. Now the locks, number four, it is Scott Barrow, who is once again the captain. And then at number five, it will be Quinton Strange. Still no sign of Whitelock. I believe that is due to a broken finger. So that is why he is out. But he's only going to be out for the next kind of few weeks or so. So it will be interesting to see what change they make when he does return from that injury. But now looking through at the loose forward trio. They have been very strong this year for their loose forwards, the Crusaders. They have had a bit of a reshuffle this week, the Crusaders. Number six, it is Pablo Matera. Number seven, Ethan Blackadder. So no Tom Christie in that starting lineup. Instead, we'll be coming off the bench in the later stages of the match. And then at number eight, it is going to be Cullen Grace. Now looking through at the back line, number nine, Mitch Drummond. Number 10, Richie Moonga. Number 11, they have gone back to George Bridge, getting to start out on that left wing. The centres will be made up of David Arvelli at number 12 and Brayden Enor at number 13. So no Fainar Nuku in the starting lineup. Instead, he is also in the same boat as Christie and will be coming off the bench for the later stages of this game. And then number 14, they have once again gone Sever Reese. And then number 15, it will be Will Jordan. So that is the starting lineup for the Crusaders. Now we look through the reserves, and they are going to be as follows. Just like the Hurricanes, there is a debut for the Crusaders, and that is in the form of number 16, Ricky Jackson. We did learn that Shilo Klein has got a three-week suspension. I believe Brody McAllister is also injured, so it does give Ricky Jackson an opportunity to be able to play, and he will be coming off the bench in the later stages. Number 17, it is George Bauer, and then number 18, they have got Tamaiti Williams. Number 19, after his successful debut last week, Zach Gallagher will once again get that opportunity at lock. Then number 20, Tom Christie. Like I mentioned, he will be coming off the bench rather than starting for this game. Number 21, it is Bryn Hall. Number 22, 
Fergus Burke, and then at number 23, I'd have to call him a super sub, even though I haven't seen him in action yet. But it is going to be Lester Fainanuku, who can bring that strength and also that speed in the later stages of this game up against the Hurricanes. But nonetheless, that is the starting lineup and reserves for both the Crusaders and the Hurricanes. Like I mentioned, this game is going to be played at Sky Stadium, 4.35pm on the Saturday, and we will be live on the channel doing our watch-along commentary, so be sure to check that out. But nonetheless, thank you all very much for tuning in. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you all for the next one.